Hello, Magical Butterfly. Welcome to the 11-1 Portal Soul Activation. This is going to be a reset for a fresh new start. Angel number 111 is bringing you the message that angels are ready to fully support you in this endeavor so that you can co-create with the universe a life you love. The affirmation is I am creative. So in the soul activation, we're going to reset your energy to help you align to a fresh new start in your life to co-create with the universe the life that you love, the life that you envision. So I want you to get comfortable. If you're sitting or lying down, just make sure that your legs and arms are not crossed. Close your eyes. Taking a deep breath in. Holding it for three seconds. And release. Taking another deep breath in. Holding it for three seconds. And release. If your mind is still going or you're still feeling energy of the day, let's take one more deep breath to release on the exhale. Take a big deep breath in, hold it for three seconds, and exhale and release. Feel it leave, feel it dissolve into the air. So I want you to bring an archangel to mind. It's an archangel that you're connected with, or if you don't have one, let one come to you. You will see this archangel begin to walk towards you. And as the angel approaches you, greet them, welcome them, and say yes to allow them to assist you in the soul activation and yes to accepting the energy I'm going to send your way. Your angel is going to point to a door that has just appeared and your angel with the move of his or her hand is going to point at it and the door is going to open. Through this door is your new beginning. Through this door is everything that is waiting for you. This fresh new start, fresh new life, and your angel is going to help you walk through it to get the creative juices flowing so you can co-create with your angel and the universe on what is meant for you on the other side. So put your hand in your angel's hand and walk towards that door. Your angel is going to stand in the doorway and allow you to walk through first, knowing that your angel is right beside you, right behind you, and is not going to leave your side and is going to guide you as you walk through this door and into this new chapter of your life. As you walk through this door, you will see a white light. And as you go a few more steps further, the picture of your new life is gonna to start to come into focus for you. Take a few moments to allow this picture to come into focus. You will see it directly in front of you. You will see the colors the sounds, the smells. This is what you envision for yourself. As this comes into focus, you look around and you see, wow, this is everything that I want. Every single thing that I want is in front of me. Wow, this is what 
I envision my life to be. This is what I envision my world to look like. Your angel is going to take you to each thing, person, place that you see and allow the wisdom to come from your angel in the next few minutes. Now that you have seen each person, place, or thing, this life that you are seeing is possible. You just need to reset your belief system in order to do that. So let's reset it by saying affirmations. Repeat after me. I am creative. I am deserving. I am worthy. I am valuable. I am loved. I don't chase. I attract what wants me by simply being me. What is meant for me is never going to pass me by. I am strong. I am fearless. I am divine. I am a manifester. I am the creator. These affirmations the ones that spoke the most to you will stay with you or you can come back and listen to them at another time but no they are here to bring you this reset for a fresh new start so I want you to thank your angel for coming through to help show you the way the way to yourself the way to your new life and know that this angel will help you each step of your way all you need to do is call them in and they will be there so as they walk away you will find yourself walking backwards out of that door and the door disappears because now you are going to create that reality in the 3d so come back to your body slowly, toes, feet, ankles, calves, knees, upper legs, hips, torso, chest, 
shoulders, arms, wrists, hands, fingers, neck, shoulders, throat, chin, cheeks, mouth, eyes, nose, forehead, top of your head, and when you're ready, open your eyes. So I'm going to pull some guidance cards for you to get you guidance messages for harvesting this new beginning. Find a sacred place in your home or anywhere you feel drawn to. Dedicate this space to finding comfort, safety, and prayer. Make this spot your altar or safe haven when time gets tough or as a daily connection. So having this safe space, this altar, this is where you can do this on a table, on the floor, get creative. And you can put things that just connect to you spiritually. A lot of people will put crystals, cards, journals, candles, whatever just calls to you, where you can go to journal, where you can go to meditate, where you can go to just connect with your crystals. If you pull cards, you can do that. But this safe haven is going to help you slip into a deep meditation and focus only on your breath. Connect to what your body needs by feeling its vibration and state of being. You will feel more in tune and intuitively aware of exactly what you need the most. So if you have a problem relaxing or you need something to calm you, I'm really getting lavender vibes from this card and also keeping sage or some type of like sage spray is going to help you in the long term and your final guidance message is sometimes we need to do something differently to have a different result doing the same thing over and over again and expecting a new result isn't successful find the solution to a problem by changing your tactic or approach so this is the reset to your new beginning having the epiphany the light bulb go off and trusting that you are always going to be pushed by spirit to rescue your physical emotional or mental body to help you not overwork yourself you need to take time to replenish your energy now you are doing too much you will be able to take a look at relationships with yourself and with others and when it's time to disconnect from the external noise, that is where your safe haven, your happy place, your altar will come in handy. I do hope this 11-1 portal soul activation has brought you clarity and guidance and it helped you see the clear picture of what your mind has been trying to show you. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe and drop a comment below to let me know how this helped you. Love and light to you.